showing gratefulness to Allah for his guidance. A Muslim owes Allah the Almighty a great debt of gratitude for helping him repent of the sins he has committed and for guiding him to the truth. The following are the best things a Muslim can possibly do to express gratitude to Allah for such blessings. 1. Holding fast to Islam and patiently enduring hardships that come one's way. It goes without saying that if a person has a priceless treasure, he will undoubtedly do his best to protect it. Islam is undeniably the best gift to mankind, for it is not a mere set of abstract ideology, nor is it a hobby which a person may practice whenever he feels like it. Rather, it is a religion and a way of life which governs a Muslim's life in all aspects without exception. Commanding his messenger to stubbornly hold fast to Islam and the teachings of the Quran, being on the right path, Allah says in the Quran, So hold fast to what has been revealed to you. You are on a straight path. Surat Az-Zukruf 43, 43 A Muslim must not feel sad if he experiences any form of hardship, for it is part of Allah's wise plan to test his servants. Allah even tested his prophets and messengers, who are far better than us, and the Quran tells us how they encountered untold suffering at the hands of relatives and enemies alike, without losing heart, weakening in their faith, or wavering under adversity. The great hardship a Muslim faces due to his dedication to the truth is one of the ways Allah tests his servant's faith. Therefore, live up to your lofty principles, try your best to pass the test, adhere to the truth under all circumstances, and constantly pray to Allah to keep you on the right path, just as the Prophet himself did. Repeat the supplication, Ya Mukalib al Kulub, Tabib Kalbi al Adinik. O Allah, controller of hearts, make my heart adhere firmly to your religion. Sunan at Termidi 2140. Allah says in this context, Do people think that once they say, We believe, they will be left alone and not put to the test? We certainly tried those who have gone before them. So Allah will certainly distinguish between those who are truthful and those who are lying. Surat al Ankabut 29 2 2. Doing one's best to call to Islam with wisdom and fair admonition. Engaging in dawah work, calling others to Islam, is undoubtedly one of the best ways of expressing gratitude to Allah, as well as one of the most effective means to remain constant in faith. If a person recovers from a life-threatening disease which has caused him a great deal of suffering and misery after discovering the right cure for his disease, he will certainly spread such a remedy amongst people, particularly amongst his relatives and closest friends. This point is elucidated as follows.